so it has detected an error again so it's fixing it now so of course it's asking us to integrate uh, superbase because uh, if we have to save invoice in a world of ai powered tools we have explored platforms like code design and doric which excel at creating visually appealing websites with minimal efforts however when it comes to building full fledged production ready web applications these tools fall short welcome to day 206 of the 1000 days of no code challenge today i'm going to introduce you to a ai tool that builds a full fledged web application meet softgen ai an ai so powerful which can convert your plain text into a full blown web application so without wasting any time let's see how it all works so to begin head over to try.softgen.ai and click on sign up and then click on continue with google use the account and click on continue accept policies create account once you're done you will be taken to dashboard and there is a pop up that opens up which says you have received 1 lakh tokens start building amazing projects by creating your first project or importing from github so let me click on let's get started i don't know which font they have used it it's a bit weird with first letter being small and then the last letter being capital some weird thing it it's not that it's definitely not uh, so user friendly anyways let me click on new project and here is where we have to give the project name as you can see we have the front end okay let me just zoom out so we have the front end which gives us uh, what are the key features and ideal for right and then we also have full stack okay and uh, you can see that uh, what are the key features in full stack and ideal for social networks business directories and so on and so forth So full stack projects come with a powerful next.js front end and superbase backend enabling you to build complex scalable applications with ease right now let me give this as a invoice chain so i want to just create a invoice generator create project so unlock superbase integration it says right uh supercharge your development workflow with a seamless superbase integration available exclusively on paid plans So if you want uh, to integrate Superbase in the backend then it is available only in the paid plans. Uh I seriously wish that they could get this uh sorted. I am opening this on a desktop and even there this doesn't seem to be right. So I wonder how beautiful the website will be. But anyways, without further discussion, let's go ahead create new task. So I'll ask is create a invoice page with the ability to add new invoice and displaying all created invoices. I seriously wish I can change the font. This is ah okay. So it writes the code. Okay, this is much similar to the platforms that we explored before, like Bold, Lovable, right? You can see that we have a preview. We have code editor where the code is getting written. using ai right and once it is generated it will allow us to see the preview until then it will show us hello world this is going to be your softgen app start by describing your project we can see that it says i'll create a comprehensive invoice management system with the ability to add new invoice and display all created invoices so it's got started generating the code required for that You can see here we have like agent is working autonomously. I can see that it says now I'll create the invoice list component to display all invoices and the main invoice page that combines both the form and list functionality. So there are five actions that is happening here. While this is getting built, I'll also quickly walk you through this bug finder. So you can see that it automatically uh, detects the bug and it started fixing it. I've identified a few. uh linting errors i'll fix this now right so you've got some errors which it is fixing so it has detected an error again so it's fixing it now 
So of course, it's asking us to integrate uh, Superbase because uh, if we have to save invoices, then we need a backend, right? And that's in the paid feature. We are not going to cover that in this particular series. Uh, it's all about, uh, what to say, having free tools and hence we will not cover them. But you already got a glimpse of how this tool works, right? Uh, you can upgrade it and uh, integrate with Superbase if required. Okay, I'll show you what it has generated for us. Okay, so you can see here invoice management system create, manage, and track your invoices with ease. Professional invoicing made simple for your business. Create invoice, track status, manage payments, right? And then we have this one. So if I click on get started, it will take us to the invoice section where we can actually create the invoice. So when I click on this one, we have a front end which says the client name, the client email, the client address, right? Along with uh, the issue date and uh, due date, okay? And we can add the description of the item or we can add a new item from here, right? Uh, notes, if anything, uh, which is optional and create invoice from here. And this looks pretty neat. Now, not just desktop, I can also see the tablet view. Okay, this is how it is going to look like in a tablet. And I can also see how it looks on a mobile screen, which is not really great i would say right you can see here this is not uh, responsive this is a bit uh off amount is outside but it's just one single prompt that i've given right so with multiple other prompts i hope it'll get better but this is of course better than not having anything right so we can prompt and take it further to enhance the look of this and make it completely responsive. You saw how it generated the UI UX, the front end basically, uh, the pop-up that opened up and also a new screen for generating the invoice. Of course, we had to connect our Superbase account to be able to generate the backend and so on and so forth. We will have a separate series which will take care of that. But I hope you got a glimpse of how the tool functions though there was a little bit of glitch in terms of responsiveness i believe with further prompting that can also get solved if you are a developer or if you are looking to develop something via white coding then give softgen a try and let me know in the comments below how your experience was that's it for today and i will see you in the next one